Hello guys, are you finding it hard to remember the mechanisms of sulfonylurea and megalitonides? If you know how insulin is normally released in the body, it is easy for you. Let me show you how. Yes, let us suppose this is pancreas and there is a beta cell in the pancreas. That is what I have zoomed here. This is the beta cell of pancreas. And inside this beta cell of pancreas, there is a channel that is called potassium channel. Now my question is, is the potassium going outside or inside? Obviously, it is going outside. Why? Because the potassium concentration is more inside the cell. So, usually the potassium is going outside in the cell. This is what usually happens in the beta cells of pancreas. But when glucose levels in the blood increases, this glucose will be taken up by the beta cell with the help of GLUT1 receptors. When the glucose is inside the cell, it will undergo glycolysis and it will release ATP, isn't it? Now, what will this ATP do? This ATP will come and block this potassium channels. That is why these are known as ATP dependent potassium channels. When this ATP dependent potassium channels are blocked, what will happen? The potassium will not go outside. So, the potassium inside the cell will increase. So, potassium is positive or negative? Potassium is positive. So, positive charges inside the cells will increase. This will cause depolarization. Whenever there is depolarization, there is activation of calcium channel. So, calcium will move inside. What will this calcium do? Calcium will cause contraction of vesicles. So, this will cause contraction of vesicles, it will cause the movement of vesicles and the vesicles will fuse with the membranes. This is what is known as exocytosis and it will release the stored molecules inside. What is stored in the vesicles of beta cells? What is beta cell storing? Tell me, beta cell releases insulin. Obviously, this is how insulin is released. Now, what are sulfonylureas and megalitonides doing? It is blocking the ATP dependent potassium channels. So, what will happen? Potassium will increase, depolarization, calcium channels will open, calcium will come inside and the vesicles will release the insulin. This is the mechanism of action. That's all. Thank you.